Bible is full of multitudes of promised blessings and we as Christians always claim to have the promised blessings and we desire to receive all those promised blessings in our lives but the promised blessings don't move or come into our lives unless a place has been prepared for them when god created adam he had already created the whole universe for adam to enjoy so unless we have prepared a perfect place for the heavenly blessings to move and dwell and to be used for the glory of the lord the promised blessings may not appear in our lives we need to prepare our hearts we need to prepare ourselves in order to receive the promised blessings blessings of the lord don't flow by itself even though we are claiming his promises nothing would happen in our lives bible says in isaiah chapter 40 fill every valley and level every mountain and then the glory of the lord shall be revealed so all of us we need to do something we need to work hard if we are claiming that we are going to receive the promised blessings what we have to do we have to prepare a place if we see any mountain if we see any disagreement in our lives we need to level the place so that the glory of the lord may flow psalmist says how good it is when brothers live in unity this is where the lord has promised his blessings lord works in unity of families lord work in unity is of our bodies and souls and spirit when jesus turned five loaves of bread into food for 5000 people he first asked people to sit down in groups of 50 each so the lord loves unity because this is where the lord has promised his eternal blessings his promised blessing may the lord bless you